Hi, my name is Seth Alvo and I've been working in the field of car audio and mobile electronics for over eight years. I've installed everything from navigation systems to full car stereo systems, remote starters, alarms, and beyond. To learn more, visit our website at www.movingon.com. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my knowledge on car audio and mobile electronics. In any musical environment, there are highs, mids, and lows. Highs are considered treble, mids are usually vocals and, and snares and things like that, and then lows, that's where your subwoofer comes in. Now bass is not directional, which means that anywhere that there's bass, you can hear it from. So oftentimes, to add bass to a car stereo, we put what's called a subwoofer into the trunk of the car. From the trunk, it sounds like it's coming from everywhere inside the car, unlike the little speakers that are up in your dash, tweeters, or the woofers that are in your door. Installing a subwoofer can help lighten the load on your car stereo speakers by letting you play them flat and using the subwoofer to pick up on all those really low frequencies. Subwoofers come in all shapes and sizes. There are small subwoofers that you can fit under a seat, there are big subwoofers that take up the entire trunk, and there are subwoofers that are everything in between. If you just want a little bit of bass in your car, we can add an 8 inch subwoofer or a 10 inch subwoofer. Some people get two 12s. Obviously, the bigger the subwoofer, the more power you're going to need to make it move. Amplifiers are always going to be needed when you add a subwoofer. If your car came with a high-end sound system, chances are you have a small subwoofer built right into it. You can usually tell if you look in your doors and your front doors and you see that there's speakers in all four and then you have some extra ones in the rear deck. A typical car stereo is going to break up if you turn up the bass too much. So oftentimes the best option is to leave the bass flat and add a small subwoofer to pick up the extra load. This way you can turn the car stereo up without your music distorting and the subwoofer is going to pick up all the bass. Because subwoofers are big and they move a lot of air, they can easily produce bass and give your music impact. It's going to make everything sound a little bit louder and it's going to make your speaker's job a little bit easier because they're not going to pick up those low frequencies that they're not designed to handle. 